Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about five reasons you haven't met your twin flame yet. So maybe you're waiting for your soulmate or specifically your twin flame because your soulmate, sometimes you're not meant to be with your soulmate. You just need to get some karmic stuff done with them this life. But if you still have not met your twin flame, I'm going to tell you five reasons why. And hopefully these five reasons will help speed up the manifestation process to meet your twin flame. So the first reason why maybe you haven't met your twin flame yet is because you are dealing with a major emotional blockage in which you believe that you are unworthy of love and being loved in return. So many people have this block in their life and it stems from childhood because their parents did not properly love them and they are still that unloved, unseen child. And so you're carrying those unconscious beliefs about reality and about love and about relationships and it's getting reflected back to you. And that could be a huge block between you and your true twin flame. And you need to overcome this block by doing shadow work, by recognizing this part of yourself, acknowledging that you have this belief that by the way is not true. You are 100% worthy of love. You are worthy of finding your twin flame, experiencing joy, companionship, love. You are so worthy of that. You need to energetically prepare yourself to receive it. Okay, and that is on to my next reason why you have not met your twin flame is that you have not prepared to meet your twin flame. In order to manifest anything in your life, you need to be 100% certain that it's going to show up in your life. If you're not and that uncertainty is there, you're creating lack and want. And that is just what you're going to keep getting back in your reality. So you cannot emit vibes or the energy of lack or wanting because you're just telling the universe, I don't have, I don't have. So the universe will say, okay, you don't have. So switch it around, prepare to meet your twin flame. Be excited about it, be happy. Evoke feelings of excitement and gratitude for when your twin flame is here. If you can get in the belief and the mindset that your twin flame is already in your life, you can really mind hack your way into already believing that they are in your life already your manifestation will appear way, way faster because you will have the certainty and the knowing because it's a reality in your mind, it will have to be a reality in reality, right? So that is another reason why you might have not met your twin flame yet. Another reason why you have not met your twin flame yet is you are not emitting the energy or you're not on the frequency yet of your ideal twin flame. So let's say, for instance, that your dream twin flame is motivated, has goals, is doing very well for themselves, they've got a career, they're healthy, you know, all these positive aspects, but you're not, okay? You're not matching that. So maybe um, you don't have goals. Maybe you don't care about your health. You have things to work on in your life and there's nothing wrong with that. Everybody is on their own path and their own self-development journey. But realize that if that is the energy of your twin flame and you don't match that, you are not going to meet them. So you have to change your dominant vibration to have the same frequency as your twin flame. You need to take action and become the person that your twin flame would want to be with. You need to become that person, literally become that person. The person that you like, the attributes that you like in that person, you have to mirror it. You got to focus on your health. You got to focus on your goals, all of these things. And trust me, when you actually get in that process, it leads me to the next reason why you have not met your twin flame yet. And that reason is you have not let go. Okay. They always say that when you're trying to manifest something, you cannot hold on too tightly. You have to let go and let the universe do the work. Trust, trust in the universe. And it's an art. Manifestation is definitely an art. You have to have a certain mindset. The more and more you do it, the better and better you get at it. But this also applies to attracting or manifesting your twin flame. Let go of it. Free yourself 
from the wanting, from the desperation, from the feeling like you just need to have it or you can't be happy. You have to just be okay with being by yourself, with not having your twin flame yet. And just have faith in the knowing that you will meet them when the time is right. Have faith in divine timing. And in the meantime, work on yourself. Become the person that has the same frequency as your twin flame. When you start working on yourself and focusing, really focusing on you, improving you, your goals, your dreams, you will automatically let go. It will happen naturally. And there won't be as much resistance there. And then your twin flame will manifest. It's funny how that happens. Believe me, as soon as you release the resistance, it just comes. That's usually how it works for me anyways. And the next reason is divine timing. It just might not be time for you. You might have made a contract before you were born. Your soul made a contract that you were going to meet certain karmic partners before your twin flame to learn certain life lessons to evolve as a soul. And you might still be in that phase of your life. But don't lose hope because eventually you will meet your twin flame. There just might be a few lessons that you need to learn first. So some practical tips to help speed up the manifestation of your twin flame are number one, focus on yourself, becoming your twin flame's twin flame, changing yourself, evolving, building your confidence, do whatever you need to do to get on that frequency. The next thing is visualization. It's very powerful. Visualize yourself with your twin flame. I love using the power of music when I visualize. It really gets me into that zone much faster. It's very powerful. Listen to inspiring, powerful, positive music that's gonna get you in that mindset of gratitude, of joy, of happiness, that you are with your twin flame. Imagine where you're gonna go, the beach, vacations. You're gonna have a big house together. You're gonna have a family, whatever your dream is, Imagine it, it's real, it's there. And the more and more you do that, the more trust you're gonna have in that dream. And trust me, it will manifest. And also, if you're dealing with major blocks about feeling love, and you'll know if you are or not, work on the shadow. I have another video called How to Heal Your Shadow Self. It's one technique that you can use to help deal with the limiting beliefs that you may have about love and being loved. You need to resolve these before your twin flame will manifest in your life. And it might take, you know, a few months, but it's well worth it. It'll be well worth it. These things need to be acknowledged and healed, completely and properly healed in order to, for you to make room for the new in your life. You need to get rid of the old in order for the new to come. You need to make space, get rid of those old stories and negative limiting beliefs that aren't even true. I hope that this helped you guys in your journey and I hope that you meet your twin flame soon. Know that they are on their way to you. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.